The thing is that LLMs have been getting bigger and bigger. And what this means is that only a few big companies have had access to extremely large scale models because it's not cheap to train them and run them. And today's video is about how we can run models on a small scale GPU, a free Google Colab instance using just a T4 GPU. And that's what's exciting and empowers a lot of developers. Now to make large language models run on consumer grade machines or smaller GPUs, it's quite difficult because in order to run a model, you ideally need multiple high-end GPUs. But to be able to run it on more affordable hardware, we can compress the model, meaning we can reduce the model size through quantization, which is a technique to compress something to enable smaller processors to run operations that are usually run by larger processors. And companies like Qualcomm with themes like Snapdragon work a lot on this. And quantization works really well on LLMs. And we will cover quantization in a video dedicated to that topic specifically. But in today's video, we will cover a concept that gives us more accuracy than even quantization. So now researchers have come up with a new strategy which involves offloading the LLM parameters to cheaper storage like RAM or SSD. And this technique is called as parameter offloading. And that's what today's video is all about. So let's talk about a bit more about parameter offloading. This technique works by loading model parameters just in time when they're needed for computation. Now you know that LLMs use multiple transformer layers, and that's what we covered in episode one of this LLM concept series. Since LLM models use layers in a fixed order, which is kind of predictable, so we can use offloading which can pre-dispatch the next layer parameters in the background ahead of time. Using this and some more techniques mentioned in the research paper, Fast Inference of Mixture of Experts Language Models with Offloading, we can run a powerful LLM like the Mixtral 8x7b on just a T4 instance, which is available for free with Google Colab. And we'll talk about this LLM in a minute. Now, there are various parameter offloading algorithms that make it possible for us to run inference on consumer grade machines. In case you haven't heard the word inference before, it's basically when the LLM is working to produce a result based on a prompt. So let me quickly tell you what this research paper talks about before we dive more into parameter offloading. Now we know LLMs use transformer architecture, which uses multiple layers for training and inference. And we can now modify this architecture by introducing something called as a sparse mixture of experts block. Mixture of expert blocks contain multiple experts, which is simply a name for layers along with the gating function, which means only some layers are active per sequence of inputs. This speeds up token generation, but does increase the model size. And Mistral AI has released a complete family of sparse mixture of expert models called Mistral 8x7b, which we were talking about earlier. But this model still requires a high-end GPU. Mistral is a huge model, a mixture of eight LLMs, all of which have seven billion parameters designed to be quite accurate and smart it outperforms 70B version of the LAMA2 model with six times faster inference and also matches GPT 3.5. Imagine if we could run a model like that on our local machine or on a free cloud instance. And in order to make this possible, we are using parameter offloading. Now the actual code example of how to get this model to work on Google Colab is something that I'll show you in another playlist, which is called the LLM and AI projects playlist on my channel. And today in this video, Let's just talk about how parameter offloading works to enable us to run a large language model like Mixtral on a small GPU. So in parameter offloading, the parameters of the LLM are divided into two categories, essential parameters and non-essential parameters. Essential parameters are those required for every inference operation and are typically kept in the main memory of the device. Non-essential parameters are those that are less frequently accessed during inference and can be offloaded to external storage. Non-essential parameters are identified based on their access patterns during inference. Parameters that are rarely accessed or are only needed for specific parts of the model architecture can be candidates for offloading. The non-essential parameters identified for offloading are stored in external storage such as solid state drives, hard disk drives, or cloud storage. These parameters are stored in a compressed or serialized format to minimize storage requirements and reduce access latency during inference. During inference, only the essential parameters are loaded into the main memory of the device. 
When non-essential parameters are required for a specific operation or layer of the model, they are loaded from external storage into the main memory on demand. To minimize latency and improve performance, parameter offloading systems often use caching and prefetching techniques. Cached copies of frequently accessed non-essential parameters may be kept in memory to reduce the need for repeated loading from external storage. Prefetching involves proactively loading non-essential parameters into memory ahead of time based on predictions or heuristics about future access patterns. Some parameter offloading systems may employ adaptive strategies to dynamically adjust the set of parameters that are offloaded based on the available resources and workload characteristics. For example, parameters may be offloaded or loaded back into memory based on memory constraints, processing demands, or the frequency of parameter access during inference. To further reduce storage requirements and access latency, parameter offloading systems may employ compression and optimization techniques. Parameters may be compressed using algorithms such as quantization, pruning, or low rank factorization to reduce their size without significantly impacting model performance. Parameter offloading techniques can be integrated with specialized hardware accelerators such as GPUs, DPUs, or ASICs to improve performance and efficiency. Hardware accelerators can accelerate the loading and processing of parameters, reducing inference latency and energy consumption. So in this video, we've learned about parameter offloading, and this will really help us when we actually have to get the mixed trial model working with our Google Colab. And I'll see you in that video. Thank you so much for watching this video and understanding the concept.